Welcome back to Let's Play Amnesia, a machine for pigs. And, uh, let's run! We're in a steam pipe and I don't know what to do. Oh, right. Case in point. This place is coming apart at the seams. And, uh... Run, what did I just do? I'm blinded. And the place is... This doesn't seem like a safe place to go. The place is blowing apart at the seams. This is your doom, Mandus. This is what you dreamt it to be. I will stop you. I will save them. You are too late. It begins. My work has begun. Kill them, my peas. Kill them all. Wait, you don't think he's, like, trying to kill off all the humans? And who is he? Little ever pull. The volume levels are still stable. They uh, they look to be anything to save them. Burn away, burn away the remnants, the parts that will not process the waste, the awful of your world. They grit the system and stick the wheels to the temple floor. I keep saying that word, awful, awful, something. Awful, awful. Why does that sound familiar? I don't know. Hmm. Oh man, I'm afraid there's gonna be pigs. And not to sneak around them pigs either. They're for your ever-loving life. PIGS! Whoa, are we back on the surface? Cool. How did we get back to the surface so quick? Oh, no. oh god, no, what have I done? Pigs are on a rampage. Oh, I guess that's kind of the point, is he's, uh... Well, when he talked about cleansing the world. Is that... Whoa! What keeps exploding? journal all the way over here. October 25th, 1899. No one misses the poor. Roundups and orphans in the world will thank you for it. Disappear a whore and a gentleman applauds you. Call a beggar and a lady walks safely again. This privilege, this pretension, these so-called leaders, these pillars of society, these rich and fanciful, they wear their filth on the inside, but they are no less dirty. I have plans for them all. We will feed them and then we will feed from them. Yeah. Go away, pigs. I'm not hiding in this house. Go on the, go the other way. Redeem yourselves. Redemption is at hand. Enter the cleansing and set your souls free. What's exploding this place? I will die as pigs. Only through my redemption can you ascend to the skies and claim the heavens. Wait, it 
reach critical. Oh, crud. October 24th, 1899. We have set aside an entire t wing of the mansion for their parties. Ah, uh, that volume is getting up a bit, isn't it? We have set aside an entire wing of the mansion for their parties. We invite them from near and far, and we guzzle them in, the, in with fine wine and the finest cuts in all of London. My god, Mandus, but these chops are rather divine. Who is your butcher? Feed them up, for the wine and the grains will also lend a character to the product. Keep the flesh relaxed, opium in the champagne and gravy, a hog roast every night for the Duke and Duchess, an actress battered and sliced, an artisan in every mouthful an importer of fine teas, stewed in his own leaves. They bicker and breed under the table, by the fireplace, on the carpet, stained with wine and fat, whilst long-dead nobles of deformed grace and cold stare watch them from gilded frames along the crooked walls. We will hose it down later, we will, as we shovel them into our machine. Oh, goodness. I think that means he was feeding them people. Eesh. Yeah, I'm lost. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> well, that tells us what time in history this was, back when it was believed that children were to be seen and not heard. Aha! Third of December, 1899. I stand and look at myself in the mirror. <clears throat> uh, vain fool, he sneers. Are you really so very different? Do you genuinely believe your works of evil are any greater than the rest of them? You are simply a weak man, a product of his age, the same as any other. This is empire, Cretan. This is the killing idiocy, the natural result of social Darwinism. If you are evil, then this world is evil. You just let the blood run in the street rather than hiding it in the poorhouse. You hold the blade and slide it home yourself. But you do not pay a man to do this for you where you cannot see it. If you're evil, at least yours is an honest evil, and that alone makes you Ubermensch, which is uh, German for Superman. And thus I wash my hands and take to bed. <laughs> well. And now I'm back in the factory. How am I weaving in and out of the factory? At least we know we're on the surface again. What is exploding? I'm going to uh, bump the volume back to its previous level there. Okay, I'll open this door. And I come Do you hear me, Madness? This is what you planned. Oh, there's a huge wall built. Is it rising out of the ground? Are we sinking? No, we couldn't be sinking otherwise we'd be worth from the sides. Is gone. 
It's very forgiving when you lose. Holy crud! It just spawned. just spawned right behind me. That scared the daylights out of me. Oh, journal entry. Mandus is the saboteur. It seems that the pressure system is indeed the Achilles heel of this facility, something I clearly did not realize in my first clumsy attempt at sabotage. If I reroute the steam, I can wreak havoc. Escaped through the pipes. In the throes of my evil, I sent children into the pipes to clean them. Then it seems likely there is another entrance I can use to escape this noxious maelstrom of vengeance. I will ignore the burning in my nostrils from the fumes that, of that godless compound dex that fuels these machines, and I will become the saboteur. I will destroy the pressure system, enabling me to enter the pipes without fear. I don't like that I have to exit the journal. All about me, the thunder of machinery, the blasts of boiling steam. I cannot pass without fear of the scalding. I am a lobster cracked. My circulation stagnated. My vital motions impeded. The steam will boil my whole... My whole boil me whole unless I can find a way to shut it off. Some form of steam regulator. I, I, I need to read these as they come out, not wait until there's a pile of them. Some form of steam regulator. I'll wager if I disable it, the damage caused by the rushing steam pressure would be catastrophic. Certainly enough to force the temporary stalling of this entire engine. That should cause the steam pressure to drop. Mandus, you clever old goat. I can feel this, feel this horror, this grief, this betrayal boil into fury. I will not stand. I will not be undertrodden. If this machine is my heirloom, I am the Overman. Spelled heirloom differently than usual. Now quickly, through the pipes, before the pressure returns and they fill with boiling corrosive steam, I sense the machine snarl itself about me, its unholy, inhuman mind coil and slick and send its dark tendrils through its conduits to repair the damage. I will return to the streets, I will fetch help, I shall lead the people upon the factory, burn it to the ground and seal this evil place underground forever. God forgive me, for what have I unleashed? I stand and smell the burning city. I see ash upon the wind. I hear the roars of the sickening beasts and screams as they fall upon the city and drag its people below for the slaughter. Now I begin to understand what the other composite ingredient of Compound X must be, and I also understand this. It is my responsibility now. I must find a way back to the heart of the machine and complete what I started. There are too many of these... Uh, these beasts loose on the street to all have come from the engine rooms as I emerged I counted three of the new three of the pneumatic lifts which suggest the machine has been planning this for some time Smuggling routes to the surface all about this neighborhood if my bearings are correct beyond the alley I should stand directly over the ignition rooms and I will wager that if I find a pneumatic there it will carry me back to the machine's heart Beast creature Where are my children? Where are my children? waiting for an answer. Aha! Oh, I see. It lifted up the uh, ground stone. Smart. Did that say pilgrim? To the pig line. Ah. And we're at the 14 minute mark, but I'm in an elevator, which seems like a really good place to call it, so I will see you next time.